So the good news is that the tornado struck when it was spring break, so most of the students were not even on campus. The ones that were are safe. But parts of TSU's main campus was damaged. The most extensive part done to the agricultural farm, and that damage will affect national research. You can see it's quite devastating. The roof was taken off and the, a lot of inside is gone. Take a walk around the campus and you'll see signs damaged. Rooftops ripped off buildings, power lines down, trees uprooted and debris scattered across the university. Hardest hit though was TSU's agricultural farm, a farm that is nationally recognized for its goal research and cattle research. We have a separate relationship with the United States Department of Agriculture. We study the effects of you know, certain things in animals and apply that at a larger, larger scale to humans. But I'm just so thankful that, that TSU didn't sustain a loss of life. So why the look at TSU with no human life lost? 25% of TSU students are from the Bluff City, and TSU is one of only six historically black colleges and universities in the state of Tennessee. HBCUs generally receive less funds than other universities, yet Glover says they produce great graduates and are vital to society. Oprah attended TSU, and there's just so many others who did. Dr. Levi Watkins, Levi Watkins, uh, invented the heart defibrillator, which shocks the heart back to life. And, you know, over two million people have benefited from that. I attended here and finished in 74. And so I've come full circle. You know, I've, as a student here, to come back now to be president. Classes were held on the campus today. Meantime, if you would like to help in the recovery efforts, just go to our website, localmemphis.com, and click on this story. In Nashville, Katina Rankin, Local 24 News.